Hi, uh, my name is Anshul and I'm taking care of uh, talent management function for uh, Uflex Group, which is India's number one packaging company in India and worldwide also. Coming over here in TMU is wonderful. It's been a great experience to me. Clear your basics, clear your concepts, try to work hard, try to work on soft skills, try to work hard on your basic concepts and you will be a ready material. My first question uh, is like, uh, what is your experience visiting our campus? Uh, uh, thank you Rajneesh, uh, first of all, for giving us this opportunity to be over here. And let me tell you, it's it's been uh, one and a half to two hours, but yes, the grandeur of your uh, whole campus has impacted me a lot, has impressed me a lot and it's a great place to be, I believe. Uh, so I'm exploring it more and more and I think uh, I'm going to get a treasure out of it. So that is what I'm expecting out of this place. And yes, the hospitality is one thing which I really wanted to uh, point out over here. Uh, you are superb in this hospitality and I'm, ex I'm still ex uh, experiencing it. Thank you, Thanks. sir. Thanks a lot for the compliment, to be honest. How do you think that this HR, these kind of events, HR conclave events are going to be helpful or instrumental in terms of, uh, you know, building the career of the students? Yeah, uh, I came to know that this is the first time that you people are organizing right, this sir. on such a big scale. And let me tell you, you should keep on doing it. Right. On a three monthly basis, the frequency depends upon you, how you want to decide upon it. But yes, it should have to be done. Because the, the gap in between the academic, academicia and uh, the corporates needs to be bridged. And how can you bridge? You can bridge it by doing the communications. These are the communication platforms which you will going to provide to your students and that is how they are going to learn that what actually corporates need and that is how you need to prepare them uh, your own self to be at that place where these people are, where these corporate people are. So there is a need, there is a very very important need that these kind of events should go and on, on and on. So once we have the technical as far as the soft skill combination, how do you think that uh, our students are going to be really uh, I mean, uh, deployed in industries? Uh, rightly said by you that uh, any interview for the first few minutes, I can say two to three minutes, depends upon the judgment of the interviewers. Right, absolutely. Uh, right, and the first impression is when, as soon as you enter into the room of that interviewer. So you people are doing it by through CTL, uh, if I am right. Right, sir. It. So that's wonderful you people are doing. It means uh, you need to work on those soft skills. Keep on doing it. Uh, try to groom students much more try to tell them that what actually corporates want and by doing this you will going to bridge the gap you will going to bridge the gap of that one to two minutes right sir so if you are doing it you are you are uh, you are giving an inch to your students right. and that inch is very much important in their career and of course because coming from this college to uh, the corporates or to the interview room that will be the first opportunity that they will be interacting with the corporates so if you are making them uh, uh, a finished product that will be good. Uh, sir, as you know that uh, the kind of world we exist right now, the kind of world we are living right now, it's VUCA in nature. The things are quite changing with very rapid rate. Yes. And uh, post-COVID era, even the recruitment change, recruitment trains, uh, trains are also getting changed. So, uh, I mean, what's your take on this? Uh, yes, of course, uh, corporates are now looking for some ready products. Okay. Instead of uh, bringing in and then giving them a large amount of time, putting, investing them, they want people to come have a kind of sense of the company and then start working on that. You mean to say ready to be deployed professionals? Ready to be deployed uh, professionals. With minimum uh, yes. input, maximum output. Yes, and that's why I told you that you need to, uh, you people need to create such kind of platforms because this is how you are going to create, you will bridge that gap. Because once you bridge that gap, you will make them corporate ready. Okay, thank you sir. Thanks a lot for valuable insights.